The person says, beat this shit is fire. But guess what? Now I'm an arsonist writer. There you go, listen to the beat. Now I'm gonna go and spit my own shit. See, I've been very dangerous, I've been very well connected. All I ever needed to do was call one of my mans up, and he got me the heater. That's my nine millimeter. But if I walk up behind you and pull that trigger, now who's bowing down, me or you? That's gonna be you hitting the floor. You ain't even able to get back up. Call no one and be able to find your body after I'm done. I'll fucking set your soul on fire. Don't you understand with that gasoline right there? That, then all I have to do is tell my man, yo, Pass me your lighter. Let me light this motherfucker on fire. That's me telling you the truth. That's me telling you that damn, I could beat up this beat. I know how to speak in tongues. I know how to talk the truth. That's why I told you I could break your jaw in this booth. I don't even care about nothing except you and my fan. That's why I told you, if you my fan, you true to me, I'm true to you. I saw my niggas, we well connected. We have guns, we have whatever we need. But yo, please do not fuck with us because we have a lot on our mind. That's why we don't try niggas, we don't even fuck with niggas. We stay together and that's all we know how to do. That's why you niggas in the industry, y'all ain't even got a clue. Watch your fucking mouths. You say you well connected, so are we. That's why we the other cities. Me, I'm the boss. That's why I can tell you, I can hang you up on a cross. I can hang you up next to Rick Ross. See, me and my crew, we know what to do when we rap. That's why I told you, I don't even talk no fake shit. This is not no petty shit, this is some raw shit. Hang you up with the cocaine flow. Don't you understand, damn, yo. I know how to sell that, yeah, yo. You want that weight, you want that product, come to me. Don't you see? This is how I spit, this is how I be. Y'all niggas always y'all were fucking blood like me and my crew. Don't you understand? We'll kill all of you. That was my old crew. So I banged out, you know, a long time ago. I stopped walking down that route. Cause you know why? Cause I learned something. God needs you to ask for forgiveness. That's exactly what I needed to do. So I had to walk down a new path. They respect me for that. I had to get jumped out. That was a long time ago when I was like 12. I guess what, that's all. That's life. It taught me how to be real. It taught me how to fight. I don't care about you beating me down no more. So I can turn my cheek and say fuck your whore. And then fuck you. And guess what, the game is over. So yeah, I am really well connected. But you see, the game that you play is not like mine. I can move you with my mom. I can make a girl come over here with my mom. That's just tough and nieces. That's what's on my mind. Don't you understand? I know what I'm doing. I know how to shut. I can break through your speakers. I can rip up this track. I can make you bump into your head. Make you only think about what I said. Don't you understand? Look at the industry. Look at most of them niggas. They look like they suck dick. Cause they are gay. Maybe you just saying no. That's the train pass on to make you happy. You may not hear me very clearly. That's the I what happened when I told you I'm about to win this fight? You can't beat me in the ring. You can't beat me in this beat. I'm trying to stand about to take over the streets. My family told me, leave my ego behind me. I told them, no, nah, never. You know why? Then I can't call myself clever. That means that I would have to drop the devil's alias. I stole it from him. So you know why? Because I knew that one day, me and him will meet right face to face. Now I have to show that nigga I'm in living grace. That's why I told the nigga a long time ago. This is like a 